this motor is a 0.55 kilowatts eight pole motor so it's slightly unusual i bought an eight pole motor because even at 50 hertz it runs at only 680 rpm which is considerably slower than what it's going to replace uh, it's replacing a four pole single phase induction motor which runs at 1425 rpm this three phase motor can run much slower if i need to have it running slowly so at 50 hertz so this is 680 rpm uh, runs like that uh, let's just reduce the frequency that's a 20 hertz it's just ticking over really let's go to the side maybe you can make that out better I think I've got a ramp down time of about one second, something like that. Uh, all the wiring is temporary. Yes, I know that it is, it is exposed. It's not staying like this. If you check out the date sheet for the motor, it's... Uh, got uh, good torque characteristics um, 0.55 kilowatts I think is going to be more than adequate or well, hopefully more than adequate for the milling machine strangely when I was looking on YouTube when I was going to buy this motor I couldn't find any videos or next to no videos showing eight pole three phase motors. I know that they are less common, they are more expensive, but um, uh, yeah, I think for this particular application, it's a, it's a good purchase. In there, but I just chomped off a depth of cut about eight mil or something like that, and it just, yeah, it's, <laughs> it doesn't even think about it. Um, mild still, obviously, uh, a much lighter cut. Anyway, if you've got any questions, just post a comment. If you're interested to see more about this machine, uh, please do subscribe and comment. Just, just ask me whatever you want to see about the machine and I can post it.